And a good Saturday evening to you. I'm Joe Holden. Those stories in a moment. But first, former President Donald Trump shifts to general election mode, campaigning for two Pennsylvania GOP candidates. Trump is rallying in Wilkesbury tonight for U.S. Senate candidate Dr. Mehmet Oz and gubernatorial candidate Doug Mastriano. Eyewitness News reporter Ryan Hughes is live outside Mohegan Sun We are told, Joe, that President Donald Trump will have a lot to say. He is here to boost the campaigns of Doug Mastriano. Triano and Dr. Oz, but experts say expect him to go directly after President Biden and the FBI. Tonight he will be rallying in front of more than 10,000 of his supporters. Some of them, we are told, have been camping out here in Wilkesbury for days. This was the scene earlier outside the Mohegan Sun Arena shortly after the doors opened. Energized and diehard supporters say they want Donald Trump to announce another bid for the White House in 2024. This has been billed as a Save America rally. The former president is trying to bolster the campaigns of both Doug Mastriano, the GOP candidate for governor, and Dr. Mehmet Oz, the celebrity heart surgeon and Republican Senate nominee. Both men spoke earlier in the evening, and both are struggling in the polls against their Democratic rivals. But all the focus will be on Trump. This is his first rally since the FBI seized classified documents from his home in Florida. And two days after President Biden blasted Trump during a speech in Philadelphia, calling him and quote MAGA Republicans a threat to our democracy. Today, Trump's supporters fired back. I think it's very important to uh, combat that divisiveness that he said he was going to be the unifier, but it doesn't seem like that's the case with Joe Biden. We have to support Donald President, John, President Donald Trump, the best president we've ever had. To be able to actually see him, to have an event so close to home that we could see him, it is like, it is, I'm like, I'm in heaven over it. And we saw some supporters drive here from as far away as Florida and California. Former President Trump, he is expected to speak on stage for quite a while. We will have a full recap of what he has to say coming up on Eyewitness News at 11. For now, though, we are live in Wilkesbury. Ryan Hughes, CBS3, Eyewitness News. Ryan, thank you for that report.